Hello and welcome to a new video. In this video we are going to explore a new code editor and it's called the Helix code editor. So it's a new kind of editor. It, it, it's not new, very new, but I just find out about it. Uh, it's like new Vim and Vim, but a bit easier to use. It has language server, uh, language server support and i think it's built in the rust programming language which make it very fast and it has also tracer integration and bunch of features that are very useful so the first thing we're gonna do is open our terminal i already have it installed and it's a fresh install you can use it in both windows and linux and also mac os so the first thing we're gonna do is check the hell to hx and uh, which stands for helix and health here you can see if you have the language server needed for for uh, for your programming language that you want to use is already installed for you so if you, we want to use c or c plus plus we are gonna need clang d which is already installed here for rust you're gonna do you're gonna need the rust analyzer it's a fish install for it's a bit fresh for Linux Mint so I don't have uh, everything installed there so Rust is not installed right now and in here for Python uh, Python compiler is not enough you will need to install the PyLS LSP which is a pip package it's on github you can find it so for now we're just gonna clear this we're just gonna cd to uh, directory that I will make the project in we're just gonna make a new C file so main.c because I have clangd installed which is the language language uh, server needed to have auto completion and other features for C and C++ so we're just gonna write include as you can see we have we have uh, auto completion in here so stdio.h which is this one and as you can see we can we get those texts which means the language server is working so we're just gonna make a main function open it which is gonna print hello world so print f and we're just gonna print uh, hello world so hello world and like this so a semicolon which is not forget it and now to save this we're just gonna press escape then we're just gonna write w and it stands for write which is in here so write and now to exit we're just gonna make the same thing but with q which is gonna quit so I prefer using GCC for compiling so GCC main dot C it's now compiled so we're just gonna open the, the application in here and we have hello world as you can see it's a very good code editor it's easy it's fast it opens fast hx main dot C and it closes fast it's like it's very productive it's it's like neo vim and uh, vim but a bit easier for the features we're gonna go to to their main website and we you can install it via the package manager and as you can see in here it has everything the only thing that is not uh, included are plugins but they are working on it which is coming in future you can see it in their uh, github page as you can see it's built in rust so it has a lot of things so in here if you go to language support you can see what is supported and what is not supported for ADA, for ADA we have syntax highlight tracer auto indent and the default LSP unit so if we go to C this is C in here so C you only need clang then you all get you're getting all the features 
so this is our video i'm just going to say bye and thank you for watching